Just in time for leaf peeping season up in the Northeast. Absolutely. It is the Funky Bow Brewery Funk in Bow. Lyman, Maine. <laughs> Waits can be when it's busy up to two hours. We yes. waited. This is why you should watch our video. Absolutely. Okay, and not click away. Think yeah. you have all the information. <laughs> Hi, in today's video, we are going to do another Harvest Host review. Yep. Uh, this one just in time for leaf peeping season up in the Northeast. Absolutely. It is the Funky Bow Brewery Funk -a -bow. in Lyman, Maine. <laughs> All right, let's get right into this. The site, um, it is located uh, just north on 35, north of the uh, intersection with 111. You're going to ask, why would I be out there? Well, if you're coming from the west and going through Sanford, you're going to be traveling 111 most likely. Mm -hmm. um, and it's actually only about six or seven miles west of I-95. There you go. So it's not much of a detour. Nope. All right. So uh, you pull in there and... It's sort of like a double drive, but you want to go in the first one. Mm -hmm. And then immediately to the right, there are Harvest Host signs. Oh, it's it's really easy to see where Harvest Host Park. Exactly. Uh, so if you are thinking you're going to go up that big hill with your rig, no, that's not where Don't you're going. Don't do it. Nope. You're going right to the right-hand side, just mm -hmm. in case nobody's there yet and mm -hmm. you're the first one to arrive. There are seven signed spaces. Seven. Yes. Yes. So, and you just sort of line your rig up and... Park it. Park it. <laughs> um, one through six are sort of all next to each other. Seven is the largest, and you could probably pull a large fifth wheel uh, towing there or something. Absolutely. Um, if it's not too busy and if uh, they are on the ball, they will come screaming down in a golf cart and they will assist you and kind of tell or you Or if where it's going to be going. busy, they'll come screaming down on a golf cart. <laughs> exactly, because not all spaces are the same size. So no. they... Uh, especially if it's a busy night, mm -hmm. which it was when we were there. Oh, well, yes, it was. Uh, they will want to uh, park you strategically because they will also uh, fit some cars in there. So yes, we'll talk about um, that when we tell you how many people were there. Yes. All right. So, yeah. What do we think of the site? Let's give, give uh, this a score. Well, I mean, it's a, there's a lot of spaces. Yes. It's nice. I mean, for the most part, flat, uh, easy to get into. You know, I, I would give it a... A B plus, really, for sight. I would give it a B. Um, the only thing being is they're not quite level. Um, and if you have a bigger rig, pulling in and out might be a little bit tricky. Mm -hmm. uh, you do want to arrive early enough. Big point here. Mm -hmm. And they do stress this. Uh, they open at 1 o'clock, Friday, Saturday, Sundays. And you want to be there because you want to get in and settle. It's very popular. We will tell yes. you that. And and you will hear music um, and <laughs> until they close and they shoot people out. So mm -hmm. um, that's the only reason I take a little bit off. Yeah. All right. So um, let's take a quick break. If you are enjoying this content, you are finding our content helpful. It is great if you can hit that like yes, button it helps absolutely. promote our channel mm -hmm. even more uh go ahead and also subscribe hit that bell for notifications because you'll be the first to learn when we post new content mm -hmm. and, also, vis and visit randy's site with regards to business or my photography site it, it helps us you know continue to be on the road and make uh great uh content here for you and all those links are down below yes and go ahead and drop us a comment uh those of you who have you see oh. uh, we do interact with our viewers so, yes we and do we love it when you leave a comment we can have a discussion absolutely all right let's move on to entertainment the entertainment or the experience or the experience yes yeah yes. so on the weekend we were there so they book local bands right yes um mostly mm -hmm. and and some that are popular um and they will book those and the night we were there and we didn't know this quite in advance no you can check their facebook page we'll leave that link down below and mm -hmm. they do keep you apprised of who's going to be playing mm -hmm. and what's going on 12 OC. 12 OC. Can I just say 12 OC? <laughs> it was the headliner there the night we were there. And they, amazing. They were absolutely amazing. I know we're giving too much away oh. here up front, but um, 
On, on Fridays and Saturdays, I think they have a, a band that's like from one to four, maybe only on Saturdays sometimes. Mm -hmm. So if you're staying on a Saturday, you can get a double header mm -hmm. um, and enjoy a band in the afternoon, sort of like an opening act from mm -hmm. one to four. Right. And then um, they didn't really start up until 5.30 or so mm -hmm. um, later. Um, and then till about nine o'clock, they do play till about nine when uh, they start to chase people out. Yes. And things clear out about by 10, yes. I would say. But let's talk about the experience location, because the location I thought was really great. Yes. It, I really did. It is. So you climb up that hill, mm -hmm. um, and if you sneak around the back parking lot, there's a small parking lot back there, and you can climb through the, the woods there, right. the trail. Mm -hmm. um, it's a little bit easier. You're not dealing with the cars. Right. Right. Um, right there, there are restrooms. Now, you went, you they went were, in. They were the nice way. and they were clean. Um, and normally in a, uh, an experience like this, you would kind of expect to see the, the outhouse, the kind of, you know, the porta potties. potties. Yeah. But no, this was this was a, a, a restroom facility. Yep. So it was great. And it's a large open area. They have uh, picnic tables under a large tent. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. They have wood-fired pizza cooking area. And they do make burgers and mm -hmm. other things. And then the separate bar area a separate bar area where you also check in to pay there is a three dollar per person cover charge well yes i think it's and the way they police they give you a wristband mm -hmm. but you can't buy a drink without having paid the cover charge right um and then they have the band under a tent mm -hmm. uh, let's let's start quickly with the food the yes. pizza was really really good i mean it's worth getting the pizza i liked it we had it for kind of a late lunch kind of experience. Yes, and that is the best time because waits can be when it's busy up to two hours. We yes. waited about 30 minutes. Right. So we decided to get that in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. And then we had a beverage in the evening with the, the main band, you know, 12 yes. OC. I, I, I like the beverage. I had a, a cider. I thought it would taste really good. The, I did find them a little bit pricey. It was $7 for a cider or a uh, beer. Um, they do offer a couple of wines as well. Um, and then they offer just beverages. I think they were like water or soda were like $2. I could be wrong though. Um, and uh, let me say right now, everything is cash. So yes, if you've already clicked cash. away from the video, this is why you should watch our video. Absolutely. Okay. And not click away. Think yeah. you have all the information. It is cash only. Now, yes. I did scroll through the comments. I spent a lot of time scrolling through comments on Harvest Toast. Mm -hmm. um, finally found that they were cash only. Now, there's an ATM there. Well, there's two ATMs. I mean, they have ATMs all over the place. So, so if you don't mind paying those surcharges, mm -hmm. but otherwise come in advance with cash. I, I think we spent about $35 in total. Right. That was for the pizza, two drinks, the cover charge. Well worth it. That yeah. 12 OC... Um, was a must see. Absolutely. And he said there might be up to 700 people there. I don't know that it was quite that much. But there was a lot of people. I mean, oh, I show pictures so I show pictures of the afternoon and then I show pictures of the evening. So you can see the difference in the amount of people. And the afternoon entertainment was just okay. It, it's it's what you expect from a house band, mm -hmm. a local band. Yeah. Um, but 12 series was just outstanding. Yes, yes. They had people dancing and have a great time. Absolutely. Yeah, really Let's hit a few of the other things. They have disc golf. It's a more That's difficult right. course if you like disc golf. You don't want to throw your frisbee around because it's through trees and everything else. Yes. Um, they also have a shack, which is for medical marijuana. Okay, and it's for medical marijuana. You have to have a card. I went in, chatted with the guy. It seemed like a nice place if that's what you need or need services in that direction. So, right. um, but aside from that, that's not their main focus. That really right. isn't. Uh, their main focus is the music, the the uh, beverages, the pizza. I, it, I really, would you go back? Absolutely. And it is family friendly. They encourage people to bring their kids and their kids go and do their thing. Oh, and the dogs. And the dogs roam free. Be prepared. Dogs roam free. Yes. Uh, but we didn't have any issues. We, we've seen people comment saying, oh, you know, a dog bothered me trying to eat my food. We didn't have any issues. We used a high top table to mm -hmm. eat and we sat on the rocks later. Right. We sat on the benches there. Uh, there's a fire pit. There's a cauldron. They come and they light that. Oh, that was really on. cool. That mm -hmm. was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. So, there. I, I mean, we could go on and on. But mm -hmm. yeah, so let's jump to the score. Uh, the cup score for for the experience. For the experience I'm going to give it an A. Uh, absolutely. Ab yeah, without hesitation. No, yeah, and and we would absolutely, mm -hmm. I think, both 
go back. So check it out. Hopefully you enjoyed this video again. We remind you to like, subscribe, um, hit that bell for notifications. And as always, keep on trekking.